Now, as you can see, my hair is shorter because I cut it um, in my other vlog. And honestly, I think it's pretty good. Like, it was super easy to actually cut the sides of the hair. The top part is long, so essentially it was an undercut. And I'm not sure how I want to go about the top part if I sort of like how to cut it down and trim it. Because I also want to kind of keep the layers. So I'm gonna play around and see what I can do. Otherwise, I like it. Um, one of my friends actually complimented it and said it looked clean. But I really like the short hair, or I think it's just I think it's just super easy to maintain. I also want to dye it because I have a box dye, brown dye from the black pink sort of hair collection. I really want to use that. But what's holding me back from using it is I needed to decide what I wanted what what hair length I wanted to keep because I didn't want to tie my hair and then just chop it off. But yeah, that's basically where we're at. Um, today is day, I don't remember. Anyways, I'm gonna probably eat and then complete the challenges and then I have some administrative stuff to do. Uh, this looks okay. delicious. I realize I don't talk in my un get ready with me. Anyways, so this is my routine. I just finished brushing, floss every single day. This is um, the beauty of Josette cleansing balm, but I put it in smaller containers because number one, I scoop it with my hands, and number two, when I travel, I just throw it in a small one. So I love to warm it up in my hands. I don't wear much makeup, but I do wear skincare, and it's like a tinted sunscreen. So it does have a little bit of color to it, meaning there's some oils that I just want to break down with this cleansing balm. And then I hop into the shower, I shampoo my hair immediately, then condition it, let it soak in while I wash the rest of my body. And then I wash the conditioner and do my final face wash with a gentle CeraVe cleanser. And that's literally all it for my washing for nighttime. Um, if I'm using a retinol, I like using the Tower 28 spray um, and you have to make sure to not use that. Actually, I'll show you guys when I'm done because so I can show up, so I can hold the bottle but my hands are greasy, so let's go shower. And then I have this moisturizing lotion courtesy of CeraVe. It's very simple. Um, I like the consistency. I just wanted something plain just to not overload my skin with a ton of different active ingredients and something I really like to do is use petroleum jelly just to really lock in all of that hydration especially because your skin gets dry overnight as you can see I do not have perfect skin the camera reflecting off the mirror blocks a lot of my acne scars for example um, like right now I see a bunch of redness um, I've struggled with acne like during COVID almost COVID gave me acne. Anyways. Mm. So yeah, then I just want to seal it in with petroleum jelly, which I'll sometimes put all over my face to slug. Um, but sometimes if I don't want to 
go super thick, I just stick to putting it on the back of my hands as well as the neck because your neck and your chest is the first place to age. So those are key areas that I really want to preserve. Hello, just came back from work. Uh, look, look how cute it is. First of all, I love this jacket. I think it's a little bit long though, especially the arms. It kind of covers me, but it's not too bad. But maybe something cropped would be nicer, honestly. Um, it would maybe just like, you know, it's obviously going to make your body proportions look nicer. Um, but also wearing the formal with the casual kind of fit. I think it's a cool style and it just mixes it up. And honestly, I never wear jeans. Or at least before, I used to always either wear cargo pants or somewhat like dress pants, trousers. But I really like, um, I've been liking jeans recently for the casual look, but I also really just enjoy a nice pair of formal wool pants. They look nice, they look clean, and they can look pretty casual. So I think it's really good to just experiment with different styles. I wanna go for a run but it's actually snowing outside when it was so warm last week for a few days. Um, I think I still could still run, but also like, I don't have to force myself to run in the cold, but I don't think it's that cold. Um, maybe my mom might yell at me if I go for a run, but I, I still want to. And maybe dye my hair, but I don't know if I should cut the back. I probably should. Smoked. This was not it, though. This is it is. No. Smoked. 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 Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Okay. So, right after the shower, while the skin is still damp, um, my skin kind of dried up a little bit. Today is my recovery day, so I'm going to be going in with this super glowing essence toner. I got this courtesy of YesStyle. Because as you can see, I've used it a lot because although I don't see a super powerful glow, like my, my skin isn't shining bright as the sun, I find it nourishing and pretty calming. Um, and I think it's something good. It has a ton of fermented... Um, fermented something, okay? Um, so I just want to make sure that my skin is getting some additional hydration. Um, so really simple, honestly just this and then I just put moisturizer on top 